Hello! And welcome to Paul and Tom. Right, welcome back. This is day six. Six. Day six of, of Reaction Week by Paul and Tom. Copyrighted. Hashtag sued. Hashtag sue us. That's it. Yeah. That is it. That's the new hashtag of this year. Right, so yesterday we watched Malfunction. Weird. Weird video. Very creative. Very creative. Um, but today we are watching. Watching. <laughs> We are watching Robert the Doll. Robert I the Doll. I have a feeling this is going to be something scary. Probably. I hate scary things. It just the title just sounds scary, yeah. doesn't it? I mean, doll. Who has dolls nowadays? Like, <laughs> it's always really scary. Um, this video has a million views, so it's quite popular. Never heard of it though. Never heard of it yet. Um, and yeah. Thanks for suggesting it. Suggesting. Suggesting it. Suggesting. Yeah, that's how you say and it. I guess we're just watching it. Let's just go, come on. As a child, who oh, hasn't dreamed okay. of a favourite doll? Or a teddy bear? Oh, 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 Forever and ever. Ah, uh, that's freaky, Robert that doll Eugene hates Otto it. had a doll who stayed with him his whole life. Okay. An artist and his muse. Oh, this is a documentary. West Florida. Right? Right, I don't know. It is, Travel Channel. What the hell this is that? This doll was given to the six-year-old Robert Eugene by the family's Bahamian maid, who was said to practice voodoo. It was the perfect kind of likeness of the young boy. That doll was disgusting. Named Robert after him. As a young boy, Eugene developed a strange fascination with Robert. Right. He spent long hours alone with his doll, talking to it. And when anything went wrong at home, Eugene always knew who to blame. It was Robert, he would tell his parents. What? Robert did it. it probably Robert was. did it. What kind of doll was that? It looks like he's made out of cork. Eugene Otto became one of the most celebrated artists in this famous artist's colony. Never heard of it. His fame grew beyond the southerly keys, as did his wealth. Fair play. He preferred to paint in seclusion, alone, indoors, with his and doll. with Robert always by his side. Creepy. What the hell, man? That's freaky. Eugene settled down with his Have wife Anne on. here at the artist's house close to Duval Street in Key West. Robert, of course, went with them. Ugh. Anne disliked the doll from the moment she first saw it. It gave her chills just too. to look at it, and she didn't like her husband's obsession with it. Still, she humored him, and Robert was given a room of his very own, away in the attic. Uh. There he stayed until Eugene told his wife that Robert was angry and demanding a room with a view. What? Despite Anne's objections, he moved Robert out of the attic and You're down to the divorced. turret room. I would burn the doll. Robert was seated at the window looking out over the street. Children on their way to school said they saw Robert through the windows moving about the turret room. This is a true story. At them. What the hell? What children Inside saw? Inside the house, they used to see Eugene became increasingly irrational and violent smashing things and lashing out at his what? wife and screaming like a madman and then all of a sudden he would be himself again and he would always say exactly the what, same the, thing the the eyes. it was got robert robert did it robert's evil seemed to grow stronger and stronger i would just rip the plumber, the dog working alone in the tourist to pieces. with robert fled the house in terror he later said he'd heard robert giggling uh. What would you actually do in that situation? <laughs> Burn him. Yeah, throw him in the fire. What the hell? Why is Other visitors swore face? that Robert's expression changed when they looked at him. Sometimes they said that he looked like pure evil. What? Eugene became sicker and sicker, becoming so despondent he locked himself away in the turret room until he finally died with Robert the doll by his side. Ah. Oh. Free at last. Anne fled the house, leaving Robert behind in the attic. What? The new owners discovered him soon after moving in. No. They took one look at Robert and knew that this, whatever it was, was something they definitely didn't want in their home. Definitely. Exactly. That's what they do with it. Robert ended up here, awaiting visitors in the East Martello Museum, where he holds an eerie fascination for everyone who sees him. Visitors to the museum, completely ignorant of this strange story, have been shocked as the expression on his face apparently changed before their very eyes. 
Yeah, right. Psychic investigators said that Robert's soul is slowly dying. His Good. hair turning white as he grows older. Ha! <laughs> Today, the artist's house where Robert once lived is a guest house. Never stay go there. I would never stay in there. Go ahead. Many years. He's still here. In the darkest recesses of the attic, say the staff, who avoid coming up here. Would never go there. I would never. And really? after her death, Eugene's wife Anne appeared here too. Her ghost stalks the turret room. Anne is trapped here now with Robert, the doll. Ah. Uh. And as for Robert, the artist, he tragically discovered that the things we love to possess sometimes end up possessing us. Well, that was freaky. That was that was really creepy. That was uh. It's weird that these things happen. You just don't know whether to believe it or not. Like, that was a, actually an official documentary. And... I believe in ghosts. I don't like to believe in ghosts. <laughs> but I do. <laughs> you always see ghosts, don't you? Only when I'm... awake. Well, that was very scary. That was. Uh, creepy. Yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, it is day six. Yes, so we got. Well, there's only one more video to go in oh, yeah. Reaction Week. Yeah, of course. Uh, thanks to whoever who sent us that link to that video. Uh, proper scary. Proper scary. I would not not like that to happen to me. I'd throw it in the fire. Yeah, we'll straight throw away. It in the fire. Put your comments below what you thought about that video. If you believe it. Yeah, if you if you believe it, exactly. Also, um, put if, what other videos you want us to watch. Yeah, exactly. Um, and yeah, we'll see you tomorrow on the last day of Paul and Tom Reaction Week. Hashtag, sue us, bitch. <laughs>